Welcome. Uh, it's War for Throne 2, one minute, five second delay, time control. We got one tough opponent here. Uh, good in FFA, good in variant play, uh, and then two inexperienced players. So it's going to be a battle for who can uh, manage red and blue the best, and who can use uh, what happens here to their advantage. So, uh, I think my first move is going to be to get set up in the middle. Blue is going to stop me from doing that right away. But, I'm going to get to the middle one way or another. Um, I was exploring this the other day. It seems like there's a there's a balance between how many how many kings to put in the center and how many to leave on the outside. If you put too many in the middle from the beginning, uh, you risk not having enough defense on the outside. So it is a balance. Um, green's under attack, so I don't have to fear this. I can head into the middle. Maybe we'll see capture. Okay. Green just gets to the middle. Smart move here. Now, what's blue going to do? Maybe that was just a clearance to promote. No. Speaking of clearance to promote, I'm a fan of this uh, this backward step. I play that pretty often. Gives a nice uh, promotion here. And now I can uh, fortify my king's defense. There. I'll wait for red to capture. Ooh, maybe red will capture and I'll uh, double attack. Okay. Looks like we're not going to go for that. Yeah, this move here, the move earlier, was a mistake. The undefended king was mine for the taking if red was uh, going to attack green. So, red and green trade off a piece each. Let's play guess the move. Yeah, we're going to see that. Now, red could capture en passant, but a lot of these uh, inexperienced players won't see that or won't know that that's an option. So, red declines that trade. I think I'm going to do a preparatory uh, support here with promotion. Um, being the, the outlook, green sees that coming, good move to make clearance there. Um, if I do that, this king's undefended. So let's instead do this, one, two, three, promote, then think about how I'm going to promote that. What else is going on here? Blue and red, not doing a whole lot of trading. Um, yeah. Still very early in the game. A lot of promotions going on, a lot of developing. Not necessarily too much excitement. Speaking of which, uh, let's do this. Let's go here. If green's going to capture, I'm okay with that. 
I'll recapture with a promotion. Some red and blue tension building up. Uh, of course. You can see this with a stalemate on blue. Maybe. I'll take my 13 points. Ugh. Okay, so now what? I think I want to take up a strong position in the center. Green is not going to let red into the center. I can be certain of that. Maybe I want to capture here. These two are holding up the promotion. With a check and here, I might take some interest in that blue king. And you got 40 points walking around on the board. Not yet. <laughs> I'll wait for red to push blue this way. And then... Then we'll throw our hat into the ring as far as uh, 40 point. As far as capturing that 40 points goes. Uh, that's got to be a good move. Maybe we'll see this and this with checkmate there, or this. Come on, here, blue. All right, so green is uh, letting us get distracted here. Green's just going to make some developing moves, slowing down red a little bit. Interesting. Uh, one, two, mate. So that's good to see. 40 points up on the scoreboard. Uh, being aggressive in the center. These are all, all pluses in my book. Let's add some more support. Maybe red will start. Uh... Okay, so red's going to retreat in the center. I'm okay with this. I'd love for green to help me clear my way to a promotion there. Here, we'll add some support again. Anytime I have the opportunity to recapture with a promotion is a good thing. And now I think, uh, yeah, maybe I want to do something like get these two kings here and here. Um, just in case red decides to go, especially when I start making a move out. Um, I'm thinking that red's going to decide that he has to do something about it. Uh, you know what? I'm okay with that. I know green's going to capture thrice there. Get some exchanges in. I'm fine with that. I'm going to put this king here. And now we're making a break for the center. My four against greens two isn't enough to hold off. Um, get into the center. And it's good to see that green is uh, going to be taking second place here. I like to see higher, the higher rated players get uh, get ahead on the scoreboard versus these um, inexperienced players. Green pretty much knows there's no way of stopping me. So 
So here next, I think. And Green's best try is that, but he doesn't even bother. So that was a good, quick game. Puts us to an even 2,400. That's pretty aesthetically pleasing, right? Anyway, that's the video. A short one for today. A miniature, 10 minutes. Uh, again, thanks for watching, and I uh, hope you enjoyed. See you guys next time.